All right, what's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Robert. If it's your first time here, do me a huge favor by dropping a like on the video and subscribing to the channel. So today we're looking at something a little bit different, and I think this might be my first kind of jersey review on the channel. So I'm excited to get this up here for you guys because I wanted to take a look at it and, well, give y'all a look at it, you know, um, because I've been collecting jerseys for uh, a few years now, you know, um, so when I saw this one was dropping, it was a no-brainer. I had to go ahead and get it. And that jersey is the 83-84 Michael Jordan UNC Tar Heels jersey. Now, I believe this is the jersey that they he was wearing when they won that title back in the day. And um, like I said, this just recently released, I don't know, maybe in the last month or so, uh, Mitchell and Ness announced they were dropping it. Actually, it was during uh, March Madness. Yeah, so... Um, they announced they were dropping it. As soon as I saw that, I had to grab it because I collect Jordan jerseys and I also have this one. This one is obviously the blue version, the Carolina blue version. I like this one too a lot. Um, but this one is a European exclusive, okay? Um, so you can't get this one in the States right now, but this one dropped last year sometime. And when I saw it, I had to grab this one as well. So just wanted to call that out. This one's pretty nice too, so... I don't know if that's going to ever come to the States, but I just wanted to show it to you really quick since we're talking about the, the white version of the jersey. So, again, here we have it, 83-84 jersey. Just going to try and, you know, talk about this a little bit and show it to you as best as I can. The first thing I noticed about picking this jersey up was the materials. Now, I know that they make this as supposed to be, you know, Mitchell Ness thing is like, you know, everything's supposed to be as accurate as it is, you know, as they can get it to the original jerseys, right? And that's why everyone goes to Mitchell Ness because they really do put out high quality jerseys, right? But I gotta be honest, I don't have many college jerseys, right? Now, I think this one retailed for $300, right? So typically that's the retail for their authentic NBA jerseys, right? So you kinda, you know, I have a few of those so I expect a certain level of quality. Now the college jersey, it is a nice jersey. Do not get me wrong. But what I will say is that the materials for the college jersey feels a lot lighter than what you get in the NBA jersey. And I think that's for a couple reasons. I noticed, I think it's a 100% polyester. Well, it's just a mesh material. That's what we're gonna call it. But I think for one reason is, if you notice here the text, you've got North Carolina 23 here, obviously, but what they use here, you can tell that it's single stitched. And a lot of the authentic NBA jerseys are double stitched. So. I think that's kind of contributing to the weight of the jersey as well because you're only using one material here and using one stitch to apply to the jersey. So that's that. So I just wanted to call it out. If you pick this jersey up, it's going to feel a lot lighter than some of your other NBA jerseys. So just figured I'd mention it. Um, okay. So taking a look at front of the jersey, you've got North Carolina there, 23. All right. Classic, classic stuff, y'all. All right, and then you've got the blue kind of rib, Carolina blue ribbing around the, um, well, it's not actually like a elastic ribbing. It's just an extension of the jersey. It's mesh as well, and that's in Carolina blue. That's another difference with this jersey as opposed to a lot of the NBA jerseys. The NBA jerseys have that kind of, um, more like a really thick ribbon around it too. That might be another reason why this jersey feels so light, but it'll be pretty cool whenever you wear it, so you won't have to worry about that. Um, let's take a look at the actual tag at the bottom here. You got 8384 Michael Jordan, and this the tag's a little different. You got College Vault here. So there's the info right there for the tag. All right. Just in case you're you know trying to pick one of these up. As you can see, I picked this up in an extra large, and we're gonna talk about that. So, sizing for this jersey, you can go true to size. I have quite a few Jordan jerseys and everything, and I always pick those up in a large. For example, the 96-97 um, Chicago Bulls jersey the black one with the pinstripes on it, right? I had that jersey, I got it in a large, and it fits pretty good. And sometimes when I, when I wear it with a t-shirt, it fits just a little bit tighter, because I think that jersey, at least on me for some reason, fit, fits a little more slim cut. So I started to get extra large, because I like a little bit of room in my jerseys. And I'll, you know, while it does fit slightly large, it still fits pretty good, and I kind of like having an extra space, you know, just for comfort. So you can go true to size, or like if you're like me, you want to one size up, you can do that. I feel like maybe I could have wore a large in this jersey, but I'm not tripping about it, you know, I, extra large is fine. But anyway, let's take a look at the back, man. You got the Jordan text on the back there in the Carolina blue, and look at that 23. 
I don't know why it's so huge. I tried to find images online of this. I couldn't find many. Yeah, I'm assuming that, you know, this was this big, the 23, because Mitchell Ness makes all their products, at least they try to make them as accurate and as close to the original as possible. So I'm guessing that's how big the 23 was, but it just looks totally different than what you get on the back of the blue version. So I don't know, maybe it was that way. Um, but just thought I would call it out. But there again, you know, as I look at the back of it, fire, fire jersey, you know, glad to have it in the collection. You've also got that kind of blue stripe down the side. Just figured I'd mention that because I saw it. But that'll be about all, guys, for the 83-84 North Carolina Michael Jordan Authentic Jersey. Please do me a favor and drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. And if you like content like this, maybe you collect jerseys or you want to see more jersey reviews on the channel, maybe I'll drop some more videos for that. Um, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you again, you know, next time.